Hi, this is Judy from ClothingPatterns101.com and today we're going to talk about manipulating darts. Manipulating darts means to move them or to in effect hide them um, so that you can maintain the shape that you would have in, in this case, a bodice without having the clunky bust dart and waist dart. This is kind of an old-fashioned look and sometimes you want something a little bit sleeker. I'm going to demonstrate by making a princess seam. And a princess seam is a nice smooth line from the waist up to the shoulder, but it has all of the shape that you have with these darts. So you can maintain a nice fitted top, but without the waist and bust dart. The first thing that you do is trace your quarter scale. We talked about quarter scales in the past. It's much easier to do these exercises in quarter scale rather than in full scale. So you use your front bust or front bodice quarter scale pattern, trace it off and then set it aside. You never make any marks on your quarter scale, so once you've traced it, set it aside. I've used a felt tip pen just because it's easier for you to see, but you would do this in pencil, obviously. Now, as I said, the princess seam is a nice smooth line from waist to shoulder. So what I'm going to actually do is move this bust dart up to the shoulder. The first step in doing that is to draw a line from the shoulder to the apex of the bust. Now that would pretty much be at the point of the side bust dart, but since when you're tracing it off you can't get all the way into the corner, I'm going just a little bit farther in. You'll then cut out your tracing and cut along that line. And I will show you that. I've already done that. I've cut, I've cut out my, quarter, my uh, front bodice and I've cut along that line from the shoulder to the bust and then you just close up that side dart and you see that your dart goes to the shoulder. So now you have a waist dart and a shoulder dart and it's very easy to see that all you need to do is connect those two. When you connect the two you can then cut that line do that here. And you'll have a center front bodice piece and you'll have a side bodice piece. Now you tape those together and smooth out that line, make it a little bit, uh, there are points here, points here, make it a nice curve, make this a nice curve if there are any points there, but basically that's a princess seam. When you sew this up, you'll have a nice smooth line from bust to waist, or from shoulder to waist. You'll have a nice fit, but you won't see any darts at all. And in fact, if you wanted to, you could do this in two different colors. You can use this seam as a method of color blocking. That's what the illusion dress is about, where you have the black at the sides of, the, of a dress, a nice bright color in the center and black at the sides, and it's a very slimming effect and it's very beautiful or you can simply use the same uh, fabric, but it just is a nice smooth seam that gives you a nice fit without the clunky darts. So next we're gonna go on to slashing and spreading and adding fullness. So we'll see you in that video.